We're not done yet. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shannon, just in case you don't know. If you're new to my channel, welcome. It's always nice to see new faces on my channel. Today we're gonna be doing a pinky, burgundy, gold kinda eye look today. I'm not really 100% sure what I'm gonna be doing. I'm just gonna kinda make it up as we go along because I tried out a few looks before the video and I didn't like them. So I'm just gonna go ahead and wing this. So if you want to wing this with me, then just stick around. Okay, so first I'm going to go in with Secrets. This is by ColourPop. One, two. Two of the eyeshadows I'm going to be using are by ColourPop. One and possibly two is by Makeup Geek. And the other one and maybe even two is going to be by this um, palette right here, Blink. We got in our BoxyCharm, I believe it was last month or the month before. So yeah, like I said, I'm not 100% sure, but I will tell you guys as we go along what I'm using. So right now I'm using Secrets by ColourPop. And I'm just gonna pop that in the crease. That'll be my transition color. Okay, so anyways, this was my Luxie 205, and now I'm going to go, nope, that was my 229, and now I'm going to go in with my 205 with Soft Core. This is also by ColourPop. And I'm just going to deepen that up just a little bit. And I'm going to be putting it down here as well. We're slowly trying to gradually build up this color to become burgundy. I'm not even so sure if I'm going to go into the Makeup Geek colors or not. Okay, so now I'm going to go into this burgundy color right here. It's a very nice metallic burgundy, and I'm just going to put it over top. I'm going to try and use a fluffier brush by Royal and Langnickel. It's an eyeshadow brush to apply that. I only really want this shimmery color on the lid. Okay, I guess I'll take this um, e.l.f. packing eyeshadow brush and I'm going to be applying this goldish color. It's like a creamy gold, really light. I'm going to be packing that on the other half of my eyelid. Just to about the halfway mark. I need to add a little bit more of that burgundy and then I'm just going to use this to kind of blend the two together right here and then I'm going to take that same gold and put some on the inner corner and then I'm going to take this little brush here by EcoTools I think it's like a small dense crease brush and I'm going to take yeah I think I'll take softcore into the lash line And then just below softcore, I'm going to take this brush and I'm going to go into Secrets. And I'm just going to soften up the softcore that I put in the lash line. And then I'm going to go back into that gold once more. And just apply a little bit of that gold in the very arch of my brow. 
and use my finger to soften it up. Then I'm just going to go into Secrets again and soften up the edges up here. And then this is I Am Loved by The Real Her. It's a lip liner, but I will be applying it to my waterline. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and add my contour. I'm using my IBY highlight and contour palette. And then we're going to add some bronzer, my Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer in the shade Light. And then I'm going to be using this Pearlescent Pink Blush by Wet n Wild. And then of course I'm going to be using my Ofra Rodeo Drive highlighter. They actually recently came out with some new highlighters and I want to try one. One is called Frosted Donut and I think that one would actually be good for me because I'm very pale. I want to try that one. It's a collab with Nikki Tutorials. I don't know if you guys saw that or not, but yeah. Totally want to try that. And then last but not least, I'm going to be using this Ofra liquid lipstick in the color Santa Ana. Okay guys, so this is the completed look. I hope you really enjoyed this tutorial. I like the way it turned out. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. I love you guys. Bye.